good evening my lovely people welcome back again to another quick tutorial in today's video i'm going to walk you through the process of updating bios in windows 10 or 11 using the windows platform please note there is difference between flashing bios in windows and flashing bios at doors and bios settings level most computers require the windows level bios flashing but after this tutorial i'll do another video on the doors level and bios level flashing BIOS updating is very important when you are experiencing crashing or hanging issues or sometimes your computer automatically turns off at a stipulated time. Let's say your computer will stay on for like 10 minutes and suddenly turns off. This is a BIOS problem and updating your BIOS will just resolve it. Also you can update BIOS if you have a higher CPU, RAM or other internal hardware and you want to upgrade to boost system performance. I will leave another video link in the description in case you wish to know more. For now, let's begin our Windows level BIOS flashing and this works for all models such as HP, Dell, Asa, Asus, Lenovo and many others. To begin, let's get the system information. On your Windows desktop, press Windows key and type system information and press enter or click on it. Now you can see the computer system information. All that we need is your computer system model, BIOS mode, and SMD BIOS version. Now use your computer model number to google for the BIOS. Click on the link to your computer manufacturer's website. Mine is HP, so I'll click on this. Please note that this process will slightly be different from other manufacturers. But if you understand the procedure, it's almost the same for the others. Now select your operating system and its version and click submit. Select the BIOS and download the latest version. But let's look at something here. This BIOS was released September 2019 and the last updated BIOS on this platform. Let's click on the details to know more. Now let's look at what the latest BIOS file will fix. As you can see, the BIOS file has been upgraded to provide security updates. Now let's download the BIOS file. After, double click on it to run the application. Accept the license agreement and click next to unzip the file. From here, the BIOS update utility windows pops up. Select update and click next. Use the recommended settings and click next again. Now let's wait for the partitions to be created. Please follow the instructions accordingly as indicated here and click next to start the BIOS flash update. But before you begin any BIOS flash update, ensure your laptop battery power level is not below 50% and that the battery is also in a good condition. This is because should any power outage interrupt the BIOS flashing process, your computer may go dead or experience booting problems. After restart your computer and you are done. Now one more last tip for BIOS updating that many people are not aware or might not tell you. I would strongly suggest you do not update BIOS if your computer is running smoothly. This is because BIOS flashing comes with some level of risk and sometimes can render your computer in dead state or no display condition. This problem may not actually come from you but rather is a flashing process which is not 100% guaranteed. When your computer gets into dead or no booting state, we computer component level technicians use an alternative way to recover your computer. We use an external BIOS programmer and some level of training in electronics engineering for this exercise. 
I will leave another BIOS update tutorial link in the description below if you want to know more. I hope this was helpful. If you find value from this tutorial, please give me a thumbs up. Also share with anyone that might need it. Consider subscribing and hit the notification bell icon for more video updates. Thanks for watching and have a blessed day.